Let's check out John Natsoulis Ceramics Festival 2012. We're here at Fort Mason, right on the water, and we're having a lot of fun. And there's a lot of international artists. We have demos and lectures all weekend. Right my, now, my uh, mentor Robert Arneson is here. You see him; he's in spirit. Uh -huh. Right. I couldn't imagine it until I walked in. 50,000 square feet of ceramic art. There is no way that I could miss John Toki's presence. I'm sure it required his forklift, hard hat, and effort to move his piece across the bay. for Clayton Thiel. I've seen his work on rooftops and outdoor displays. From inside, it appears to be a doorway to another world. I've experienced Cedric's metal sculptures before. Now I'm checking out his ceramic pieces. Cedric's strong voice matches his art. It's a nice craft. This, you know, all of these as a craft, it just feels so good to look at. And grounded. Mm -hmm. gra it's, it's, a, it's a grounded aesthetic. Mm -hmm. yeah. These are wonderful, they're different, they're yeah. very delicate craft. Uh -huh. They're nice. That, Personally, that with cool. my taste, I think there's a certain presence to that. that I like really that Hey, my name is Wes Horn. We're here at the Ceramics Annual of America 2012 at the Fort Mason Center here in San Francisco. Beautiful San Francisco. And uh, standing here at the far end of the hall here with some of my mosaics, a California bench centerpiece, got the mantis chair, sardine bench, flame bench. No, it, it supposedly it says sardines, but okay. it could say west just as oh, okay. easily, right? Yeah. But the inspiration behind this was the Monterey Bay Aquarium, and they have the round, okay. you know, aquarium uh, yeah. tubes, and those were my favorite things from the aquarium. So oh, okay. Made a bench basin. But yeah, if you haven't come already, make it down to the Stromach Channel of America. We're glad to have you.